welcome everybody to a new episode of the Lords of Lobak. Yeah, we are very happy to be here. We are very happy. And uh, we are being... Uh, and let's say, let's just start with this. Lah. We care oh. about mental health. <laughs> yeah, mental health is very important. Wait, I, I care about mental health. I thought we were just doing accent. What the hell are you guys? Good, what the hell <laughs> you guys doing? <laughs> From <laughs> accents, this this guy <laughs> went into some other. <laughs> this is the way I speak now. <laughs> <laughs> I spoke about mental health. He went mental. Yeah. <laughs> There's a character that sounds like this, right? Uh, Pee Wee uh, Herman. I don't know. I don't know. Like, uh, is there a frog? I don't know. It sounds like some frog. Oh, Kermit. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Kermit, yeah. Kermit the yeah. frog. Yeah. Yeah. Kermit. Yeah, I don't know. I cannot do it. Sorry, <laughs> that's Mickey Mouse. <laughs> Uh, Seth MacFarlane does yeah, a really do good comedy. He can do it. So. Oh, yeah. yeah. He did the whole Taken yes, line in on Kermit's uh, voice. Uh, uh, what was the show? The, skills the Graham Norton show, yeah, right? Graham, yeah. Graham Norton. Yeah. But we have to start this one with a very disheartening news. I mean, I don't know whether we can trust it from... That uh, we support that uh, that mental health? No, no. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> you know, rapists, pedophile pedophiles uh, murderers and all yeah Sean is twitching eh? you know, just mentally unstable they are all yeah. mentally unstable people and they need our support but they're not at least they're not delusional are they, I mean, some of them might be delusional they but might but be delusional they might but be delusional. they need all the help that we can give them yes they do they do they do right and you know but that's how you're going to make the world a better place yeah. by showering everyone with unconditional love Yes. No matter what they've done, no, no matter, matter the what crimes they've that they've committed, that, that is why you don't fight hate with in hate. In this, in this studio, Hitler is a revered figure. <laughs> he wanted to stop the corruption of the banking system. Yes, but you know the evil has prevailed. Yeah, and now everything's corrupt. That's why we have the two thousand eight crash. Correct. I, I, do, I, do, I, I don't know if I, 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 I don't know I think this one might be taken down The moment it just goes <laughs> up <laughs> This one might just go up I can't believe I'm I'm the voice of reason now <laughs> You guys are supposed to be The voice of reason I'm the one that's supposed to go No mental. no But we can accept You know Like we can accept certain things That you know Hitler was a failure <laughs> y- Yes A huge failure But you know If he had Access to Oh shit counselors. Now I know why he's going with that one <laughs> Yeah <laughs> If he had access to counsellors, proper mental health uh, workers, yeah, he would have not done what he did. Absolutely not. Yeah, absolutely not. Yeah, he right. would have realized his mistake. If Mussolini was given the opportunity to play catch with his dad mm-hmm. at the ripe old age of nineteen, mm. he would have not done what he did. He would not have become a dictator. A fascist. I think he he might he might just be like making pizza in a pizza shop. Yeah, good yeah. pizza as well. I mean that name Mussolini Mussolini pizza. Best pizza in whole Rome. Yeah. How many how many Michelin stars? Mu- Mussolini Michelin Mu- stars. What the heck? Mussolini's cannellini. Oh, uh, whatever. Yeah, cannelloni or whatever. By now we have Mussolini. known him. Oh, have you checked out Mussolini's cafe? They have the best pizza in the whole of Italy. Yeah, right? Exactly. We that that would have been his legacy. It's yeah. To, it's to die for. Exactly. <laughs> You know, yeah, and, and Stalin and all these kind. Of Stalin, Stalin is actually a bigger, uh, a, b- a bigger genocidist than no, no, not genocidist, a bigger mass murderer than Hitler. than both of them combined. Yeah. yeah, yeah, he sent a lot of people to die for Mother Russia, for Mother Russia, yeah, and the Red Army, Mao, yeah. like all these people, right? They uh, all just I mean, they started help. out white, but they got caught red because they were in the words of blood. a girl that used to work in Stickies, who is Mao? Who's Mao? <laughs> Now, <laughs> now, 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 let's not shame people. <laughs> uh, no, you didn't mention the name. Ah, okay. Yeah, I didn't mention the name. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then you go do it now. <laughs> no, our, 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 our bleak I can't remember the name, actually. Uh, the less after, later, later. Uh, uh, this one's already going to be taken down. Uh, it's okay, uh, I guess. Yeah. So it's, uh, uh, that's how much of an impression she left she on me. <laughs> I can't remember the fucking name. After, after she said, who's Mao? Who's okay, Mao? What? And he turned off. But yeah, mental health people, they really need help. And they need it a lot right now in Canada. In Canada, yeah. In Canada. They need it, they need, they need all the help they can get. If, uh, because our, our, our revered, we revere someone else. So, I mean, you guys more than me. Jordan B. Jo- P- yeah, Jordan B. Peterson. Dr. He Jordan B. This Peterson. Guy voice of reason in this. Uh, man. The only voice of this sound logic. chaos. Mm, yeah. 
he might be the only one uh, who has you know some sense yeah and sadly and i think he's being uh he's being uh what you call that demonized for it but not not just not just him being smart and everything he saw the future yes mm. yeah he saw the future. He saw this is where we are going, or where, the where land of Canada. Where is going. it was headed if yeah. they approved it. Actually, it's not, it's not even just Canada. It's all around the world. Yeah, and the those attitudes are slowly creeping eastwards. Yeah, right. So those sentiments, right, that were really prevalent in Can like places like Canada, the UK, the US, mostly on college campuses, universities. The far left, yeah. Right, the far left, young, impressionable, mostly women. Yeah. Right? Mostly women because they don't really think with their brains. They think with their hearts. Emotions take over. And then they... Not all women. Not all women. Not all women. There are smart women out there. Yeah. But those women who think with their hearts, they made the most amount of noise. Yep. They created the most... (laughs) Like blah and all this kind of bullshit, and then people started to take them seriously because they wanted to get in their pants. Yes. Yes. Probably. So yeah. So, so we have to blame the Sims. Yeah, dude. The Sims gave these women or these whores the, the voice, power, the voice, the <laughs> voice. Yeah. Yeah. The voice of treason. Fucking ridiculous notions were just thrown. Uh, were being thrown about yeah. like as if they things, had uh, you any can't you can't call a person a mother now. What in Canada? Oh no, I think I I think in England. They they want to do it in England f- or it came out in England. They're introducing it in England or something. You can't call a mother mother because that's very uh like oh I think it's Australia. I think it's closer than we think. It's, you can't call someone uh, you're your encouraged not to call someone a mother. You call a child bearing Parent. Childbearing person, right? Childbearing person or something. Oh, I, think, I think Yanni Pappas was making a joke about this, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So something like okay, that. Okay, so I've got this list, right? Gender inclusive language ah, introduced. Gender okay? inclusive language. So women, now you got woman, person, them, they. Breastfeeding, chest feeding. Breast milk, human milk, chest milk. Maternal, maternity. Parental. Mothers birthing parents. What? Birthing parents, yeah. No. So mothers birthing parents. Instead of mothers. Birthing, birthing, birthing parents. parents. Wow. Birthing parent. Non birthing parent. So you're the non birthing parent? You're the birthing birthing parent? Yeah. And then the picture is just a a young toddler sucking on tits. <laughs> yeah. So so that's that's how it's been driven now. That yeah. they have this they have this inclusivity so that uh, maybe a transgender person or a person transitioning or a couple, a gay couple, uh goes in and you know, that's how they refer to them. So, you know, they don't feel uh excluded. Right. And it's gotten to such a level where Jordan B. Peterson actually tweeted an article of a man in Canada who is facing jail time. A, f- a father, not a just father, any man. A, a father, father is facing jail time. A non-birthing parent in if they if they get their way. Yeah. So a father after calling his biologically female child daughter. Right. And uh, okay... The article is kind of bi- not say bias. Uh, it's written towards, uh, it leans towards uh, yeah, bias. Uh, leans towards, uh, because I mean, it starts with that he was held in contempt for that, right? Because uh, the daughter, or in this case, wants to be called son, right? Or wants to and be the pronouns is they, right? Not even son. Uh, just doesn't want me. She and her wants to be. Yeah, I don't know what they she wants. Uh, he. Right. I guess that's what. So while in court, when he referred to his daughter, biologically female girl, yeah, as daughter, because I mean, he saw her as a child, a baby, saw her grow up as a girl, and yeah, so it's his daughter, but he's not allowed to call her because, uh, that she, she wants she to feels become abused. a boy. Yeah, she feels abused by him calling her daughter when she wants to be a boy. Is it? Yeah. So abuse now. I mean, we spoke earlier. Uh, uh, breaking wind. If you want to catch that, 
that's abuse the ones we the ones yeah. we covered there that's abuse there was physical abuse there there was actually a lot of physical abuse there was a uh, uh, sexual abuse this this is someone who is i we're not even allowed to say they are disturbed or they are ill or anything because this is someone who is transitioning tra- uh, tra- like doesn't feel right with mm. her thing we we can't use those words now now we, we can't even refer to them as anything we, we're supposed to treat it like normal we're supposed yeah. to treat something that uh years before science has proved uh, probably proven that it's dysphoria right uh, that it might not be full I, I think it's because the science is too weak the study is too too weak that people are but then again they are flat earthers so who's to say what shit no but uh, actually <laughs> the, the the thing is that I have no idea. I, the I, I third sex has always existed. The intersex and uh not even intersex. Like there there is a uh scientific reason that could be given, a uh, scientific logic mm. that would follow this. That there there are hormone imbalances, something happened mm. and even though the person was born a female, the person feels like the person should be a male, or the uh, or the, the other way around, vice versa, yeah. vice versa, right? Yeah, that has always existed, but it's known as an, an it's an it's an abnormality, right? It's an abnormality, right? Mm. So, uh, in history, people have dealt with it in various different ways, yeah, right? So, eventually, like as we have crept towards the nineteen twentieth century, now twenty first century, we have dealt with it by saying that, yeah, if you want. There are avenues for you. You can transition fully by doing a s- couple of surgeries, and legally, we will recognize that you have to change your sex. And this is what the doctor wanted to do. Yes, yeah. but for that surgery to happen and all this kind of shit to happen, the parents will have to approve it, right? Uh, usually, they don't allow you to do it as a child. Mm. Yeah. So you need to go through all the psychological evaluations and. And when you become an an adult, when you turn eighteen, lah, basically, when you turn eighteen or twenty one in whichever yeah. jurisdictions you you live in, yeah, that's when you get to decide what you want to do. Oh yeah, and that's why right? the father didn't want it to happen. Yeah, he so there are many risks involved. Risks involved in this, right? So there are people who transition and then suddenly they feel that I I did the wrong thing. Yeah, mm-hmm. right. So then then there are some people who after they lose their genitalia, they are like. Oh, I don't actually, I actually miss it, and I actually don't f- find that I'm complete without what I chopped off or whatever yeah. I've added to myself right now, and all this kind of shit. But even without going through the operation, the amount of hormones and, and drugs yes, that you yes. take that can, yeah, that that will have a irre- irreversible yeah. impact if on the child. That, that's yes. apparently especially what if the, the child is like still growing and still maturing, you know, and correct, and, and things correct. like that. So yeah, so there are so many things that you have to consider. That is why it's not. A black or a uh, black or white thing, or it's not binary. Yeah, to use that term. Yeah. Yeah. And um, the problem is that in certain countries like in the UK, in America, in Australia, in Canada, the age of transition, right? It's a very contentious thing now because the whole LGBTQ or whatever lobby that is going on right now. Yeah. It's getting stronger and they are lobbying for kids who are as young as like five years old, seven years old to already decide on Yeah, decide on their own fucking gender and say that yeah, like I want to be a boy. Oh, okay. I want to be a girl. Uh, So so if a parent sees a boy playing with a doll Yeah, I I think I think he wants to be a girl. I think I should start feeding this person hormones. Yes. And fucking up his life. Can can anybody like uh, yeah. Like where where has so that that is abuse in my in my opinion. Where that, has that, 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 well, that's where abuse. where has our logic gone? Where where has sound reasoning become sense become treated like this harmful meanness? Yeah. Where, where, why why is now? And and let's not forget, uh, any other thing, right? That a kid wants to do when the kid is underage, they need consent. They, they need, need consent. consent. But this yeah. apparently. But this thing, right? If. Your your parent wants to take control. Now the parent's evil. Mm. You can't like the school. If the school wants to bring you out on an excursion, the school needs your parents to fucking sign a form. Mm. Yeah, 
but now it becomes like if you want to trans transition you should be allowed to and do if the, so. And yeah. if one of the parents says, I don't think my kid yeah. is ready, which is this case, suddenly the, which, the father has been demonized. Yeah, which yes. is, this article says so that the, 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 the 14-year-old boy, uh, 14-year-old girl w- who wants to transition to a boy now wants to uh, have a court order that the father cannot prevent it. Mm. So the father cannot prevent her going through gender affirmation uh, treatment so, yeah. for dysphoria. Yeah. Which in Canada yeah. now? So for this, right, it most likely would it, she wants to become a boy, right? She wants to become a boy. So most likely, f- male hormone therapy and uh, yeah, whatever. Uh, mastectomy. Mm. I don't know what surgery she would do mm. down below. So it's, it, it, it's so a it's, lot it's quite irri- severe, yeah, man. So it's it's, irri- it's irreversible. So the, to yeah. the, father, the yeah. father is saying no. You you, yeah. you you do it like really later, but she wants to do it now. So I think because uh, for them it's. Uh, the earlier you do it, apparently, maybe the 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 transition will be a lot more, like yeah. f- like quicker and all that. Yeah. So the father's point of view is probably like you are. I mean, he he noticed, uh, behavior. There was hmm. suicide. She was suicidal. Yeah. But her suicidal thing was because she had a crush on male teachers. On two male teachers, very obsessive crush on two male teachers. Right. Who of course, rejected because she was very young. So that's the thing. He already saw from that is like you're you're not sure. Yeah. You are confused and you don't handle things like that properly. Well, yeah. You already the girl was just being a girl, lah. Yeah. Uh, that's yeah. that's the thing. So the father is already noticing this, and now from from the father's perspective is that you are confused. Hmm. You. I like how. Sorry, sorry to interrupt, but I like how the article does the article ma- mention the mother. Uh no, the mother is uh supportive of it. Ah, yeah. Thing, supportive see, of the thing. Th- then you can see the split Fucking in the. Fucking women. <laughs> so the thing is, the father. You can you can roughly tell how the family unit worked or didn't work yeah. from this. You, you just, can just see, from you can inferring. see where logic lies. Yeah, just from inferring to this. Yeah. You know? I think I I I think from this is just that maybe they should the people over there should yeah. just stop having kids. <laughs> the, the f- no dysphoria if you have no kids. What? No, I think it comes down to parenting, man. I think really, yeah. really comes no, down to parenting. It used, and, to and down, it used to come down to parenting, but over there, I think that's why Jordan Peterson was ag- so against the Bill 16 being passed. Uh, because, C- 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 because you're giving C- a leeway for, for this, this kind of ideology to be pushed forth. open the floodgates, because I th- yeah. that's, that's where he's coming from. It's like you, you, no one understands it enough, and you're going to pass something that is restrictive. Even, even the drugs, man. Like even the drugs that they're pumping into a kids, no one really fully understand the amount yeah. of damage it's gonna do that, in the long that run. That thing, yeah. and now they yeah. want to force an ideology on everyone using law, yeah. using law. Which like is this dangerous. pronoun yeah. thing. Look, the father is held in contempt just for calling his daughter daughter. Mm. They're referring to her as she, because he's not comfortable. I mean, he sees the 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 the, the damage of the damage is that now you give you give this when you make it law, right? No one has the choice. You took away everyone's choice. Yeah. On how they, w- you are basically bullying people into, uh, not being bullies in a in a sense. You are yeah. forcing people to be nice, and you know that, that 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 skewed logic, right? The the intention is yeah. You your intention, you see them as pure. You you see them like we were making the world a better place through force. Mm. You, you think making the world a better place when people are forced to be nice. You know what th- what happens right? that, that builds up a lot of resentment. Right. And you can actually see it on display now very yes. clearly. This th- the Asian hate that's going on. Uh, in, in actually I don't believe this Asian hate. I mean bullshit, uh, 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 or, or, or a certain no, a certain things like you yeah. can you can understand where why they're so dumb. Yeah. Because they 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 no, I don't think it's dumb. Be, right? I don't think it's dumb at all. I think it is totally different. The guy went in and killed for some other reason. But it's being pushed out as Asian yeah, yeah. hate. The, the, uh, I, I didn't mean to bring it there. I, yeah. I, 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 knew, I knew where was this was going. I didn't no, mean to No, because there are Asian American s- journalists right. who are saying that, hey, what, what is this fucking cringe word? Like, someone, at they, one of the channels actually posted a video mm. where they are trying to push this agenda that Asian Americans are being targeted. Right. And it, other journalists, American. Asian American journalists, Korean, Chinese, and all—they are like, "Hey, this doesn't exist. Don't take isolated incidents and then lump everything in together and claim that this Asian is hate. Yeah. there's there's overwhelming Asian hate." Mm. Hey, 
if you are going to take all these kind of isolated incidents and clump everything together, you can say that there's white hate, there's black hate, there's brown hate. Mm. Yeah. No, there's I think every fucking hate going on on a daily basis in America. N- my 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 point I think was I think that someone was mentioning. Uh, I was reading somewhere that what uh, stats said ever since the COVID outbreak happened. Yeah, three thousand like plus cases in in one month or something. Like there was an increase in like yeah, uh, in attacks in against Asian but Americans. Yeah. But that that was just a subplot. My yeah. my point is that that's what's happening over there. They claim to be all this nice and polite. I mean, like mm. this this freedom loving people. But you see what they're doing. It's not not I'm not not lumping it together. The Asian hate thing is just the, the what's happening over there. But the thing that some guy just went in went to a spa and shot people up, yeah. and they are supposed to be what, uh, you know, land on the free uh, home of the brave and all that, right? And yeah. the Canada's doing uh, the other the other way around. They're, what they're trying to force their citizens to be nice by in implementing rules like this, where you no longer can if that person. I I I, w- I want to be referred to as a day, and you refuse mm. to call that person a day. You are somehow abusing so that crime. person as a hate crime, a hate crime and yeah. you go to jail. And yeah. then now because no, you of get that, a fine first, uh, you get a fine first, and then but the thing is that now you are forced to call people what they want to be called, and that causes that will cause resentment. In some and you actually don't even know what they want to be called. Y- you don't know, and the you thing have is to that interact the with them first. The idea is that right? they yeah. didn't earn that. Eh. The the other thing is that it was not there's no earning there you know is you choose to want to be called that I don't know your pa- your journey I don't know your your stuff when I know that kind of thing right I would be inclined to call you whatever you want to call I've uh, heard your hard stories like you were abused as child you went through a lot of things you went through treatment and then you fully transformed you now want to be called he fine transform <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like a Trying. butterfly you would like a butterfly. <laughs> <laughs> but you want to be called that, then fine. You know, you you, yeah. you relay your things that you want to be yeah. called he, fine. Yeah. But that's my choice to respect you and call you he. I shouldn't be forced to call you he. Cause just, and it already backfires. There were there were cases of one guy who who identifies as a woman, went to a massage, uh, went to a uh, 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 waxing salon or something, mm. and and because the lady they don't serve men. Yeah. But this person is trans transgender and identify as her, but still has all the genitalia. Right. Mm. Uh, I think suit her. I think I don't know whether I mentioned it before, but suit her. And because she didn't have uh enough money, I think she had to close down or or Jesus. Or, yeah. or, or she might be forced to close down because uh if if it goes. This through, is in Canada, is it? I have no idea. I cannot remember. It might be one so of them. The right. Thing. But the thing is that this guy. Yeah. This transgender, p- uh, not even trans, this person identifies as a woman, still has the genitalia, and also claims to be a lesbian. Right. Interesting. You know how 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 fucking sh- stupid yeah, yeah. that sounds. Yeah, it's the yeah. same with the this kid. It's one. just it. It can sound like a fucking perverse guy who identifies and wants his balls touched by a female. They yeah. have actually, th- they have all the rights, you know, because they don't handle male genitalia. Yeah. yeah. They only do waxing for women. Yeah. They should have the right to say no, but yeah. by rephrasing and and changing around, this, this guy this guy can easily be a predator. He can just he enter into women's washroom and be like, easy. "Yeah, I, I mean, identify as woman. On. I identify as woman, but I'm a lesbian." Yeah, who? It sounds like a freaking comedy. Like that's a comedy. You know, like one of those uh, like creepy fellas. That yeah, that, that's one of their plots. Like I, I would, I will say I'm, I'm because now you don't even have to trans transition. Yeah. You get. You just have to identify as that that sex. Just just ask any mother lah. With the kid in the, in the mother and daughter in the washroom, and then I enter the washroom and be like, yeah, fuck it, I'm a woman. Yeah, I identify as her. Yeah, I'm just gonna pee beside the store. Yeah, where where you are right now. Uh, because you know? that I think that's and what you a, saw. A, a, any lady will be like, uh, can you please yeah, fuck that, off before yeah. I call security or something? Yeah. You Anyone know? and they have the right to do that. You have male genitalia. Yeah. You're not in. You're but not I can flip it around in Canada and say, is that hate crime? Yeah. That Are you discriminating th- against this me? Is, this is the against thing. me using a woman's bathroom, and yeah. and because they put it into law now, be- I think lawyers will uh, anywhere is like, hey, this is they can play around with the you know wordings and all that. Yeah, it's like, yeah, it's a hate crime. Yeah, actually, we you we owe him money for emotional. We, we still need to see like, like is it like you can just like identify as that mm. or. Do you really need to have that like some have form of like certification documentation? documentation. Yeah. Saying that but it's yeah. so easy in Canada. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You can just go to like a doctor, a GP, and say that I feel this way, and I want to give me a letter. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> that's what Lauren that's Southern did. That's the yeah. <laughs> that's the thing. She see, took a letter from a GP mm. yeah. and said that I, I identify as a male. Yeah, 
I want to change my ID. Mm. Even though she has like long, like she has all Blonde. the look, lookings of a of a woman lah. Yeah. No, like she has still have the tits and everything. And Every yeah. Yeah. Dude, that's that's the thing. That that's the that's the big uh, the big thing staring the the beast uh, the the beast and that's staring yeah, at them. And right the now. doctor, right? Didn't want to get into any trouble. So he just let it by refusing her that that letter. Just wrote the letter and she went to um uh I think it was uh like the department that does your licenses mm-hmm. and everything. Yeah. Just change the sex. Yeah. And to make it that easy, you know how damaging that could be, you know, or or how it seemingly very because it's yeah. now seen as non-progressive. You're against the idea, but there's very little studies, and now the the worst thing is now studies are all thrown. Be, I mean, partly no, because partly because of like we can't trust that there oh, yeah, is yeah. no longer any trust. But be- because gender studies, right? Yeah, that whole department or that that whole. It's well, just, just creator, bullshit. Right, yeah. yeah, it's bullshit. That, they the don't thing. have serious uh, academics working there. Mm. They don't have any serious science. They reject science mm. when yeah. it comes to gender studies. It's all fucking made up shit. It's like fairy tale shit that has it's like and feelings. And are. Feelings trump everything. No, yeah. that, that has been given uh, credence yeah. how, and how been given a spot in academia, in universities, and now. They are parading around saying that yeah we are going to make shit up and we are going to advise people uh, because it's dangerous making policies yeah it's because dangerous. you know because uh, as much as we all want to be run by our brains heart is the one that trumps really everything because you know you make someone feel good and they're, they're technically more inclined to agree to mm. yeah shit so you make one group happy you just introduce that you want to make another group happy you introduce this yeah but the thing is that you no longer any validation in the studies of what could happen mm. and the thing is that when people who are in the field start who mm. who are a- uh, experts on it are now treated like you know y- y- your opinion no longer matters because it sounds mean mm. like your your studies don't matter because it sounds mean uh, how how have we progressed how is that progression how do we go from now uh, w- biologically uh, male female People just because they want to, you know, you can't. The, the other thing is that you can't study that. You, you, how do you prove somebody to somebody that I feel like a woman? Yeah. Like, you know, uh, when they don't think with their heads and they don't exercise <laughs> uh, logic. But that, that's the thing. Like he just said, you go inside. The <laughs> everyone's taking digs. Huh? <laughs> so uh, you say go into a GP and then you just say. I feel like, and yeah. the doctor, because of a law that th- yeah. you know, I don't want to hurt your feelings and get cancelled. Yeah, but cancelled. you see, right? A GP should not be able to. That's like, the thing. <laughs> like, like give you like a fucking uh, small, a tiny cheat, and like yeah, yeah. This yeah. this is allows like, you, you know, to change your sex. This like, feels like someone yeah. you know is yeah, supposed to be MC. the uh, fucking psychological evaluation and all yeah. this kind of shit. Like, yeah. I never heard of it someone king gender. Yeah. <laughs> if, if it's that easy, right? I would. Change my sex to woman so that I can use a female bathroom because female bathrooms are way cleaner than men's bathroom. Uh, no, apparently and not. And smelling better. No, maybe smell better, but apparently. Well, not. the ones I used it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Mine was from uh from 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 yeah, from this female episode, but This episode is definitely it's it's it goes straight to Patreon. <laughs> yeah, it's probably probably <laughs> probably la. No, the ones that I used, uh, uh, no one was in there. I checked first. I'm like, hello, cleaning. <laughs> 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 then no one answered. Like, okay, I shall take a shit here. I because mean, it in, smells in nicer. Canada, you can probably just use the other one. Like, that you identify yeah. as female. And then, okay, okay like, what you said, like, there will be, you have to have the documentation. Like, but still, yeah. I think, I think they, they jumped the gun on it. Like. They, 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 they jumped on this nice bandwagon thingy. And I, it's okay to be nice. But just to be nice. But w- I, I prefer if your niceness was sincere. <laughs> like, not for, when you put a law there and something you force people to be nice, it's no longer sincere. It's the worst kind of being nice. Yeah. It's an it's somebody inviting you to the house. This person is fucking racist, a bigot. Law makes him nice. Yeah. So he but he's a fun guy. <laughs> but he's, but a he's a fun guy. <laughs> but like what t- Timothy always say. Yeah. <laughs> he's, he's an alcoholic. He's a fun guy. He's a drug addict, but yeah. he's a fun guy. He's a fun guy. But kids the thing is that needs l- some of these kids need lines. <laughs> <laughs> But it doesn't change who he is. He's still racist. He's still what? He's only yeah, false. Yeah, that's a fun guy. <laughs> hey, I'm white. Get it? <laughs> get it? You get it? Timmy D. Timmy D, man. Timmy oh, D. Oh, his latest uh, fucking skit. 
Yeah. <laughs> the b- barbecue after quarantine. Oh <laughs> my god. <laughs> barbecue after. Qu- <laughs> oh man. <laughs> that is like one minute plus of pure wildness. The Damn. content is just mad. Yeah. Mad. <sighs> I just hope that w- no, I but like you know, no, like no, I just hope it doesn't pol- like trickle down. Uh. I I agree with you. Like you know, you try to be kind, you try to help people, you try to do nice things for people, and what do you get rewarded with? Jail, jail. <laughs> like what happened to the, this guy, this man? He wanted to be nice. He wanted to help young women who are struggling to earn a living. <laughs> Give them a job. Give them, give them some meaning in life, you know. Security. Tell them that they can uh, afford a house, buy a car in the buy future. Buy a car, buy a bag. Support themselves and their Support family. Themselves. Yeah, this stand on their own feet. This guy should be a hero. This guy should be a hero. But what's happening now? He's being accused. Yeah, of being a predator. Of being a predator of cheating. Which we completely disagree. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> His name is... Is so weird. Oh, it's so weird. D B S, D B S Wong Tian Jun. Yeah. But th- th- how do you spell D B S? D B S like D B S D E then space space B S B S. See, some people shouldn't be allowed to name name themselves. I don't know. It sounds like a Dutch or like a South African. But B E I R S right? There's there's a B E B S or something or B B I E R S. Yeah. D B S Wong Tian. But his actions were dubious. But <laughs> and he rhymes. It rhymes. D- no, the thing is D- that D- if yes. if you, I think his parents knew that you know if you want to if you have given birth Holy to a criminal to a degenerate father, degenerate put put a beer in there lah. I, I you put a beer in there. Or you you know you name your kid weird. He <laughs> probably named himself Dubious. <laughs> I mean, if his parents <laughs> name him Dubious, uh, you know the father or the mother was drunk at Dr- one point. Drunk drugs. Oh, say so what do you want to name your your they, kid? Uh, they just knew that this kid was going to be this was one. going to be helpful. But the starting yeah. of this article make it so like makes it sound so pathetic. Unable to afford the services of sex workers. The man pretended to be an agent for rich. Ma- maybe children. that was the reasoning he gave to the police maybe, once. Maybe. He was like arrested and pulled like in. I got no money for like sex workers. Are they very expensive? Or maybe he has a very high standard of what he should the service should be. Uh, maybe. maybe and he paid for it for a few times and it's like no, this is not up to standard. And if I'm not wrong, he advertised <laughs> on Locanto as well. Is it? <laughs> Yes, Locanto thing. I need uh. to check that out. A lot of things are happening yeah, on, yeah, on Locanto. Locanto is wild. L O C A N T O. Find us there, <laughs> listeners. <laughs> he duped 11 people. 11, pe- 11 girls. Not people, girls. 11 women into having sex with him so he could purportedly test them out. Yeah, so not only did he have sex with them, I think what the first victim that they highlighted, he took pictures of her first. Education. I, I need to. Education people. I need this. I need these pictures to show to the clients. It, it starts with education yeah. and, you know, shit, man. Hey, but you see, yeah, if you're educated, you know that, you know, sex sells, you can make good money, yeah, and you'll just be an informed sex worker. Yeah. Right? You, you will know how to take care of yourself, how to price yourself, mm-hmm. what kind of clients you are after and all those kind of things, so you will make informed... Most of the time, you make informed decisions, lah. Right. Right. <laughs> These <laughs> girls <laughs> had no clue what the fuck was going on. They were naive. Holy crap! The guy is thirty nine. He yeah. looks like he's he in his fifties. Like yeah, bro. Damn. Yeah. So the first girl he met, he took pictures of her and everything, and he said that yeah, I need to test. I test need to go for a la. test run. Yeah. QC check, lah. QC check. QC check. Yeah. So he banged her. Right. All right. And then after that, she started having episodes of flashbacks. Right. PTSD. Was the sex that bad? She f- she, felt <laughs> she felt that she was in Kabul. <laughs> or in Baghdad. <laughs> or in Mosul. Yeah, in Baghdad in 20, tw- 2003. 2003. Yeah. Right? This bitch started complaining, saying that... Oh, 8,000... I, I'm traumatized. Yeah, his, his dick was so small and worked so hard for an orgasm. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever fuck happened there. La, but she started complaining all this kind of shit. Might as well just say that you had sex thinking that it was going to be in return of something. 
of services provided that these that this man would provide you. Yeah. And then nothing happened. Nothing happened. Right. And then you came up with all this kind of bullshit. That sounds more legit actually. Because technically you were going to prostitute yourself. If you said that you are yeah, you're going to sleep for money, right? You're going to sleep for money in yeah. exchange of money, right? And it's not a relationship that's going to be legit as well. Mm. Who's going to be paying you like $8,000, $10,000 per month? Yeah, unless for you sex. unless you find a rich sugar daddy lah. Yeah, sugar but yeah, but who's going to do the sugar daddy is most likely going to be married. Mm. It's going to have a family. It's going to be doing it on the side. Or if Sean strikes Toto tomorrow. Yeah. Sugar daddy, bro. Then we see Sean in uh, at Locanto. No, because like, I know now that they're, they're, they're willing. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. How so, so much willing because it's so easy money. He just, exactly. He, and this fellow had no money. He had no money. And <laughs> the thing is that how, how, how he pulled this off I, I, d- I don't think he had any skill in the thing. No. All he oh, did was lie and lie hey, and lie. Yeah, but that's the sign of a good entrepreneur. <laughs> no, the thing is that he didn't make any money make from this. Make it to you. Fake it to you. Make he it. He didn't make any money from this. Yeah, he, he didn't make any no, money from this. No, he didn't make money, he didn't have, but he had, he had something he, in exchange. He had orgasms in exchange. Yeah. And he, oh. But look, God, at, he, look he, at him. He, I think he benefited, benefited more yeah. from the sex than the women. Yeah. Let's just put it that way. If he was not offering them like a job or something, mm, or uh, the, the chance to make yeah. money in the future, I don't think they'll sleep with him. Yeah. Yes. Jesus Christ, man! This, this, wow! The du- the duping process was. I just think that they should have been a little bit more. S- I I, will, <laughs> I mean, come a on, little man. more, uh, a little more wiser. A wise, yeah, wisdom. You know, it could easily you can easily manipulate it and say that you know. You, you pull this rape. on a guy, it would never work. You, you, yeah, yeah, yeah. But you pull it on a guy, it would never work. Because the, I mean, the, con- the implied oh consent yeah, no. was that I'm going to get something yeah. from this. Yeah. So if there was nothing coming out of this, so you can argue that she did not consent to sex without any benefits. Yeah. Wow. Unpro- but it's tricky though, because then she will be a tricky. prostitute. Uh, she can be considered like a yeah. prostituting herself. She is right? a prostitute. <laughs> but isn't that illegal? No. Like it is illegal. Yeah. So yeah. it's like both die together kind of shit. Something like that. But is, is anything going to happen to those girls? No. No, because they actually did not go to the extent of giving sex they did for exchange of oh money. no 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 money yeah. this one they got yeah, nothing yeah. this one they got nothing they they actually so kept giving they, they had hang on so the fact that he did not pay them makes them get away scot free yes technically yeah <laughs> technically, <laughs> technically <laughs> yes and yeah. no and now they are the victims now exactly the victim, right yeah. if he paid them they would be kind of like in hot water as well yeah because then I they would be offered they, if they went to report the thing but now they did not get paid so if they Repo- I think they reported the thing. That's cheating, la. Yeah, yeah. Basically, they were cheated, la. They were cheated, right. uh, Out of. Uh, but yeah, I but, don't know. But man. my my thing is like, the fact that they are now now they're victims is because they didn't get paid. Yeah, they didn't get yeah. paid. Yeah. yeah, so it all it's worked out. Cheat, right? it, worked, it all worked out okay. Only the guy is suffering. No, y- you see, people <laughs> say that it's a m- it's it's a man's world, mm. but now it it's not that case. It's becoming more and more of a of a woman's world. No, I, I, I worry about that because you just saw 11 women get duped by the easiest no, but scam that ever. That is because they are gullible and naive. I mean, Or I greedy. They want money. These they women, yeah. these no, women they're, they're were gu- gullible and naive. No, yeah. I think they were just hungry for money. Oh, yeah. Sugar, the, 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 no, that, the, that's the why thing I said they were lured they by they sugar daddy. By the, <laughs> by the sugar daddy thing. Yeah. And it's actually, I thought it would be harder to dupe women because only guys, I would think guys were easier because uh, most... Sex scams involve guys like you know the lady say send me money yeah and the guys don't get anything and then they just send money really That's, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, who when but when multiple number multiple of all men. all usually huh? elderly men yeah oh uh, elderly men with no smartphone and have no knowledge of only yeah, fans yeah yeah so you see that probably. that case right but probably. even that could be an avenue for yeah hustling no, but but it's actually no the, true the, I would true. think it's actually a lot more you know that that scam is actually a lot more intricate to pull off 
Oh, I don't know. Maybe it's easy. I'm, I'm, I'm not sure from that thing. But mm. this one. But there are multiple scams, what? Yeah, multiple. But this one is just he puts on a classified ad, right? And nothing to back it, no. <laughs> I. But I think got to give credit where credit is due, lah. He's probably a very good speaker and managed to sweet talk the eleven but women. You know what would be the funniest thing, you know? Like just lie. <laughs> <laughs> like imagine like he said that he's an agent for like the super, super rich yeah, or whatever, super rich. right? Eight thousand to twenty thousand dollars a month. That's yeah. what he promised. So him. he promised all of that, right? It's good money. <laughs> I'm I'm curious to know, right, where did he bang these girls? Hotel eighty one. Oh eighty <laughs> one. No, this girl. I think only one girl. Actually. Yeah. Then but the rest. The one girl came out to say that. Oh, the, the that rest. I don't know whether I don't know whether the rest got. Yeah. Her. But this one girl is the one. So that, said, that, uh, that one girl that actually went to hotel eighty one, right? But she was. Uh, like I saying, think uh, she's uh, also from the Totti school, man. Uh, like what the fuck? Uh, <laughs> like. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if you're if you're if your clientele is multi multi millionaires, right? Don't make that thing, please. It's gonna be a thing. It's gonna be a thing. The school of the tortoise. Don't make that thing, please. But but this but this girl is the ninety nine tortoise that one of the ninety nine that lost lost the race. Yeah. 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 She's not the winning tortoise. <laughs> like holy shit! Like you are going in to meet someone who is apparently representing high rollers. And you have and to meet at hotel. And this guy is going to meet you at hotel eighty one. No red flags, man. Yeah, no. at least MBS lah, MBS sweet or something, yeah. you know. That would prove that no, you are anything that is not fragrance or hotel yeah. eighty one. No like budget hotel. Fuck it hell. Like Jesus. Even Ibis is better than hotel eighty one. <laughs> <laughs> Like come on, like this w- speaking from experience, uh. Yeah, and that's what? why she's got no, Ibis. Ibis is a world-renowned hotel yeah. chain. Right, you go to fucking most uh, civilized countries, you will find Ibis. Ibis, Ibis. Ibis hotel, yeah. yeah, yeah, near the airport, like in the city center, there'll be an Ibis somewhere around there for you to. It's Ibis. like a traveler's lodge, lah. Yeah, it's like a traveler's lodge. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So at least that, but no, hotel eighty one. And Still no reflex. Yeah. She had unprotected sex with him. Eh. Unprotected, yeah. This is icing on the cake. Wow. Unprotected so, sex. Let's hope she didn't catch anything. Or he didn't catch it. Wait, but he's also a dumb fuck one. Why? Because if he knows that these girls who want to be sugar babies, right, they probably have fucked around quite a bit. And the fact that he went in there raw. He was wow. willing. Dude, wow, this, this guy is willing guy, to roll the this dice. This guy is just horny. He's willing to roll the he's dice. He's horny. The whole thing he got in trouble for was being horny. Yeah. He's being horny and all he did was yeah. horny yeah. and he didn't have money, so he found a way. Yeah. <laughs> so 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 if if you want to spin it in his in his favor, right, you can say that yeah. this guy was a uh uh very what's what's a good word this uh very uh, enterprising. Enterprising is one, but it's the other one. He he's he has a perseverance in in him mm. a drive right an unbridled drive driven by to commit a crime to co- <laughs> he's tenacious he's tenacious tenacious and all this tenacious tenacity came from his horniness <laughs> yeah his second yeah, brain did a lot of thinking multiple words man yeah. yeah his second brain did a lot of thinking yeah and now he has a face jail time yeah yeah, he's yet to be sentenced, so yeah, let's see yeah, what let I mean, it will be harsh if, the, if if somebody's gonna get 30 weeks for abusing his own. Wait, mother. but did he circulate the, the fucking uh, uh, pictures? Not, mm, I think because he if he's sent to. Because if he circulate that, you can be charged with uh, yeah. distribution of pornography, so right? So I that's a second, a second charge. A lot, yeah. I think he has 10 charges against him, or that's why they're reviewing what to, what to do. I don't know. I think he's going to jail, a happy man. <laughs> <laughs> Then the jailmates will be like, hey bro, got lobang lah. Say, yeah, yeah. Hey, like, bro, go bad, lo canto, you? Go lo canto, set up a classified hey, ad. Not uh. bad, uh, bro. You're not bad, ah. Uh. Not bad. Okay, in terms of Craigslist and Locanto, which one is better? I've never used I think b- Craigslist either. is like, like dead. But it's a Western uh. thing, right? Craigslist? Hmm? Craigslist is Western thing. American, a very American, American thing. thing. Very American thing. The, the one that was wo- the one that was worldwide and the one that had the most, like, I, I think got like the most fucked up uh, press was Backpage. Backpage? Yeah. Right. Sounds so ba- Backpage... Sounds horrible. So sounds horrible. So Backpage was identical to Craigslist. Mm. Right. Right? So they had like uh, like the adults like... Section. Uh, like yeah. basically like hookers lah. Yeah. yeah. And it was like worldwide. Mm. Okay? But it's based in America. So right. the founders and all were based in America. They got indicted for running... The website, no, like an online 
prostitution ring. Yeah. Some so they were like charged that with that. Right. So the back page is now. So this no but Craigslist actually is not just adult shit, no. You no, can no, like no. go sell a car. Same thing. You same can, thing. Yeah. The back page so is the same thing. Yeah. Ah. So, so they have classified. It's just classified for everything. Mm. So it's like. Like but the thing was that people were just looking at back like hookers carousel la. for yeah. hookers. Carousel, right. but, yeah. but this one for, yeah. But for hookers, yeah. Locanto. Like Craigslist, you can get rental properties, you can buy cars, you can... In the who, UK, it's Gumtree, I think. Gumtree. Yeah, Gumtree. Who set up Locanto, I wonder? Is it Locanto is also worldwide. Oh, worldwide. Sounds like an Indonesian. Mm. Yeah. So, I think Locanto. Lo- Locanto yeah. is like local classified mm. or some shit like that. La. It should, yeah. have, should stand for some classified. shit like that. But yeah. Yeah. yeah, his story will be time li- to do in our jail research. I- in jail, he's gonna be like, "Hey, what, what are you in for?" No, I, I think duped eleven women. Into I think his time in jail will be well spent because he'll get to know other criminals, and he's gonna come out and he's gonna s- uh, we set might be looking at the new uh, entrepreneurial uh, 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 venture. We, we might be looking at the new um, <laughs> <mob> boss. <laughs> he, uh. He's gonna get. <laughs> His venture capitalist will be fucking uh, secret society. Oh, Lukanto is an app, bro. <laughs> it's an app, nah. Yeah. It's no, no. D- it w- it's a website. It I think now I they have now the app. Now, like. now it starts as an app. Yeah. Same thing with Gumtree and all. Just everything, it was just everything a website. has to have an app now. All right. Categories. Let's see. Women. Whole for personals. Sure. Personals. Yeah. Casual encounters. Can, can, you find his, can you find his ad? Men looking for women. Yes. Can you find uh, his ad? Men looking for women. No, but can you find his ad? One plus one equals oh, heart. But I want. Right? One, one plus one, one equals, equals heart. heart. <laughs> I want uh, one standing me plus three. No, that's an advert. Just. Oh, an advert. One plus Anyone one. Anyone actually real on this app? 36 years. Caucasian male, 36, looking to chat, share, suck, fuck, and meet up with people looking for discreet. Sexual activity. Ooh, <laughs> interesting. <laughs> Only one result. What? What for? DBA. For men looking for women, in Singapore. There's only one result. What the fuck is this? What about sexual pre- sexual pleasures? Ah, uh, now we have it. Any girl wanna hang out? Thirty five years. For thirty five years? <laughs> no, no. The guy who <laughs> put out that marriage, bro. <laughs> Wait, years you, no, <laughs> you just like, want to hang out for 35 like, years like Man wants to hang out with a girl 35 years <laughs> like, That's a bit long uh. That's like a fucking prison sentence <laughs> So how much are you going to pay me man? A few hundred thousand dollars It's like for upkeep well, no, there's no, There was no conversation About uh, fucking uh, What do you call that? Money Just yeah. said that you want to hang out or not I mean I'm pretty sure this one is going to be taken down Because of all the things at the start But still I had a good chat. <laughs> <laughs> had a good chat. We will go do our 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 research now. Uh, hopefully, find the BS. Yeah. Eat, eating lesbian pussy. Nineteen. Hello, beautiful ladies. I'm a nineteen-year-old girl who wants to have some taste with your pussy. Mm. <laughs> mm. Can be of any race, any age. Prefer to have a receiver as I like to be the dom. Must be open to try new things. Blah 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 blah. I think this is a guy, dude. Yeah. I think it's definitely a guy. See? Immediately, immediately... Uh, definitely a guy. You think this is a catfish? catfish. Yeah. Definitely a guy. He go there, ident- identify as a... <laughs> as, <laughs> as a female. Uh, I identify as a female and I feel still attracted to S- women. Serving males who crave for hey. sex and foreplay. That's Dom, me. Dom but receiver. Oh. Dom but receiver. Oh, what I, is this? I don't know what that is. Golden retriever. Huh? <laughs> no, I'm, I'm here to satisfy lonely girls who crave for sexual pleasure in all forms. For more... Details, please drop me a Serving message. Males serving meals who, who crave, crave for, for sex, sex and foreplay. Should I reply to this and say, hey, are you describing me? <laughs> no, serving <laughs> meals. This is a guy offering. Yeah, yeah, God. offering women, yeah, uh, to, to milf. milfs. Should I reply to that? Are you, I, I feel that you've described me. <laughs> yeah. The perfect age 32 years. Yeah. Did you just set this up and This is my first it. time going on Locanto, so this is not my ad. Don't lie. <laughs> it sounds like you. Eh. It's your double yeah, And you're there. turning 32 this year, so. Very suspicious, Very right? suspicious. Sus. Either yes, I am. Very, very sus. It's June, yeah. He, I'm he, he, either that or, or, you know, you set it up when you were drunk one day. <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, then you just said it actually. This is so weird. He said yeah. it up when he was drunk, and then you just, no, this I sounds <laughs> like me. He's <laughs> <laughs> like, it is me. And then you reply, and then you yeah. see your notification. Come Someone on. message. I have like, a Locanto. Uh, account? Like <laughs> no, he tries to sign up for an account. They said this email is already, already been used. used. <laughs> and then, yeah, like he, said, oh, like, he no. gets a notification yeah. in his uh, Gmail or something. He's like, eh? Hey? Yeah. Oh, apparently I already signed up for it. And it was last June. No, no, this kind of shit, you need to create a whole new email for it. 
<laughs> probably. Yeah. And and it's uh, it's probably going to be one of those ridiculous emails. Like yeah. Searching for milf. Searching yeah. for number four yeah. for yeah. milf yeah. at gmail.com. At, at gmail.com. gmail.com. That, yeah. that sounds like a good one. I think no. it's already taken. No. <laughs> <laughs> for this kind of shit, I need to use hotmail. Uh, <laughs> oh Yahoo, 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 yeah. Yahoo, yeah. Yahoo. Keep it, keep it pro, keep it pro, pro with uh, Gmail, and then everything else yeah. just go. Yeah, yeah. Gmail is work email lah. Gmail, yeah, yeah it's work. It's, it's yeah. Or serious. you go, or you download Tor browser, and then you go, you know, the dark oh, the web. Dark and you create web. A I don't think I'm ready for the secure, dark web. Uh, secure website. I don't think I'm ready for that shit. <laughs> Why? Um, stuff you can find there. The people too what lah. No, Hitman if you search for it lah, fuck. Hitman for hire. You, no, you know it's you can. Too tempting. You okay? can. You no, you can use your normal. Hitman for hire. Hitman for it's just too tempting. No, you can use Tor browser, but you can, you can like go YouTube and watch normal videos. But I you would can be too tempted. I'm not saying that wow. I I'm scared. I'm just like I don't want. Too tempted open, for what? I don't how, but how secure box. do you think it is? Tor. Yeah, I don't, I don't well, apparently it's harder to trade. No, you get less ads also because it's uh. Yeah, la, no, as yeah. in the moment you open it up on your com, right? I think of like course several don't. hundred people already are in th- uh, on your com with you at the same time. I think like no, but a lot of people actually use it. A lot of people I know like they they go Facebook, they go YouTube, they they do their emails and stuff like normal shit, right? They just don't want to have ads. They just use it as a browser, nah, like pop ups and ads. Oh, yeah, know. yeah, you can do all normal shit with that. Yeah, yeah, la, but. I, it opens just too much. It's a Pandora box. It just if I open that box, I don't know if I can close it again. You wow. never know what will come out. Yeah, Let, let's better not record y- the things y- that will come out if you yeah. on yeah. the podcast. Yeah, you don't need to mention it now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to look into your search history on uh yeah, on, on Google. Door. And then he was like, "What? What the hell? <laughs> Midget assassin required? <laughs> Midget assassin? Yeah, inconspicuous. Uh. You want to you want to go on the down low? Uh. You never see him coming. <laughs> you open the door, no one's here, and then you got shot. You got shot, shot right in the balls. Either that, or they will be like, "Who's this cute guy? Yeah. Cute lady coming yeah. in?" And then he then turns down. around, and then it's a gun. It's yeah. like, oh yeah. shit! The midget assassin. Apparently, you can get guns in Singapore. There was that one story that guy managed to smuggle a gun in to Singapore. What story? When when was uh, this? I can't remember. The bo- the 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 gangster wannabe. He smuggled a gun in and used it to scare off, uh, scare off people. Scare huh? the other gang. When when was this? Oh wow, I I, c- I can get the the story up. Was it a real gun? Real gun, from Malaysia. Many years ago, right? The last time uh, I heard yeah, someone ago. using a gun in Singapore was the one one, one eye dragon. dragon that was yeah, in the sixties. Yeah. No, la, late sixties. No me? No. Seventies. That was. Late nineties or early two thousands, what? Really? He killed the fella in. Uh, oh, sorry. This was in this Lido. Was recent. Oh, he Three killed the fella in Lido. Shot in Lido. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's yeah. an assassin. Yeah, the, the guy, guy was, was an assassin. assassin. Yeah, right. An actual one-eyed dragon, right. and it was wasn't referring to his other gun. Mm. Yeah, seven years caning for gang member who kept loaded pistol bullets in Jurong West flat. This was recent. He managed to smuggle it in. Wow. A loaded gun. And it wasn't a plating, not airsoft gun. And this mm. was a loaded gun from Malaysia. How did he get caught, though? Uh, the, uh, I think someone he he flaunted it, and then someone Do called the police. Do they have his name? name? Uh, Muhammad oh, Ikram yeah, okay. Abdul okay, okay. Aziz. You just had to say the first first part of the name. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, <laughs> it was it was uh, someone slighted his friends or something, or, yeah. or and then he bo- he he managed to smuggle <laughs> a gun in. Uh. Oh sorry, close friend's ex wife was assaulted by a gang member. Yeah. God damn man. See hot pistol. Yeah, but Malaysia don't play lah. Malaysia No, if they brought it in he brought it into Singapore. Like yeah. he got it past Yeah, but yeah, but the thing is that he got it past and then he was stupid enough to But thankfully he didn't discharge. Discharge I think he Finish. Finish it. Yeah. Seven years jail dude for for no, owning but if he possession of the possession. gun, right? Yeah, death, right? Death. Yeah. Using it, I think it's death mm. immediately. So he one count of unlawful possession of a firearm under the Arms Offenses Act. Yeah, he was not charged with drug related or secret society. Oh, he's not charged with drug related or secret society offenses. That's interesting. I think at that point they couldn't charge him with that secret mm. society because he wasn't acting on behalf of any. Yeah, object. it was yeah. a personal like. It right. was a personal thing. But I thought if you are if you are affiliated with, uh, but we are not sure if he's affiliated or not. Uh. N- he, we, Someone he knows he knows the the people that he he flaunted in oh yeah. are no, it says well according to the article lah. Hang on, hang on, hang on. No, the people he was uh, trying to threaten were a gang for another gang. 
No, yeah, they uh, the top of an article. Yeah, who, who belong to a secret? So who belong to a secret? But he didn't do it on. He didn't do it as a gang member. Mm. Yeah, so he belonged to a secret he society. He belonged well. to them, but yeah. he didn't do it uh, as, as a, a gang, gang member. member. He yeah. did it on his own because the other gang member assaulted his friends, yeah. his close friends' wife, and yeah. it was like he do it. He did it on his own behalf, like not the gang member say go. Mm. Yeah, the heads probably be like yeah Dude, we didn't we didn't get him to the, the bring pretty, a gun into pretty Singapore. Pretty impressed with him. Managed to yeah. smuggle in a gun, you know. He might be no, I, no actually the they won't be impressed. They'll be like, what the fuck yeah. are you doing? You're bringing oh. so much heat. Yeah, yeah. So much they heat probably up. like but had a back channel call to ISD like, bro, this one is on him lah. Yeah, or maybe, yeah. maybe that. He, 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 no we didn't ask him to bring him a gun. There's no drug gun smuggling here. Because if the if the if the Singapore if the police force find out that the gang had anything to do with that, right? That's it, dude. Yeah, or they, could be, they could go yeah. down quite bad yeah. for that. So there should be some back channel talks, lah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. See, I shouldn't allow myself to be on tour. <laughs> <laughs> no one is going to be selling this kind of shit on tour, <laughs> la. No, no one's going to be selling guns. Hire, don't do it yourself. Hire, hire a midget, midget <laughs> assassin. Get rid of your rivals, <laughs> any kind of rivals. So let's not open that 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 that, that box, okay? Yeah. And on that, you note, go you go on tour and top secret CIA files. Ah, ah yeah. that kind. Don't no, but message. you don't need Thor for that. Then suddenly you? a message, ding, message. we are watching. Yeah. Yeah. Not <gasps> message, uh, you, you suddenly see a, uh, a little no, then, tiny then, thing uh, in a thing. And then your laptop drone. camera, your laptop camera just turns on. It's like, wait a minute, yeah. what is happening? Drone, we have you, we know your location. Uh, say your prayers. Yeah. Shh, one smart missile comes in. All right. That's probably what's going to happen that after this one. On yeah. that note. <laughs> on that note. Ciao, Ciao, guys. Ciao. Ciao.